Hey guys, and welcome back to Kuon. Okay, so we just saw uh, the two little girls run right by the library. We're definitely in the right place for whatever we need to be doing. And uh, in the last part I learned uh, the shortcut to the map and how to meditate. And we got this whole temple area open, and I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to be doing. But I guess I'm gonna go ahead and head to the study where I assume those little girls might be. Temple North. And there's this man that's been humming. Go away. Hurry. Before the cocoon takes you. But... Never mind me. I've had a good life. Watch out for the sick. If they don't merge with other creatures soon, they will die. Corpses are needed for their cocoons. They were like, shut up, old man. Medicine jar. Medicine jar is protected by Yakushi the healer. Okay, it must have been... Uh, his head has been twisted all the way around. Yikes. Huh. Okay. I guess I should... get the heck out of here. I wonder... I guess... I mean, that must be a healing item, right? Or is it a quest item, I wonder? Oh! Medicine jar... Okay, it is a quest item. Interesting. Oh my goodness. You know what? Forget this. I keep missing... Oh my god, I hear those little girls now. Oh, I didn't know it could... Oh my... Please just... That's not what I meant to do. Why am I missing? <sighs> that was pure panic and very bad on my part. Um... I need to figure out where I'm gonna go. There's like an X mark over here. Why is that? Oh my god! Oh my god, please get out of there. No. Absolutely not. Run! Please run. I'm not moving. I don't know why I'm not moving, but I'm not moving. I'm gonna go ahead and run a little bit, and then... Oh jeez. Get off. Okay. Um, I guess that, that was why. But I got the cocoon removed, so that's cool. And then I'm pretty sure that door was the one I came from. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and go this way, I guess. I only have one save left, which I'm kind of worried about. Um, I'd really like to find another save soon. <gasps> Wow. So, <laughs> in the last part I was like, I really hope I find a map. I found it instantly in this part. I was like, I really hope I find a save. <laughs> don't like that. Really don't like that. Um... Oh, there's an item I'm missing. Summon card. Kagutsu Ona. Puppet Woman Obey- Ooh. Ooh, I'm excited about that. That sounds badass. Is there anything else over here? Nope. So I guess now, um, we're gonna go downstairs and see what's down there. Oh. <sighs> well, I guess now we know what's down there. The red woman in her boxes. 
she sure does love boxes. Everything's yeah, fine. It's okay. <sighs> I hear the children. I definitely hear the children. Um. Hmm. I can. Well, let me see. I can go here. Or I can go the other way. I mean, I'm already here. I might as well. There's a box here. Ooh, and a letter. Yakushi's legend, stone table inscribed with the tale of Yakushi. The Buddha Emerald Light, the master of medicine, he is the deity who heals the sick. He has a merciful look on his face and holds a medicine jar in his left hand. Okay. So that must be who we met, who just died. And there's a, a box here I guess we'll check out. There is nothing useful. Um... I don't... I don't know if I want to go out there... yet. But I will. I will. I'm already here. Oh, it's a save! That's awesome. Um... I mean, I probably should save. I have two of them now. So... <laughs> I have that going for me, and now I only have one, but at least I'll have saved. So, if anything happens, like, I'm pretty sure it will because, I mean, we literally just saw the, the red woman, we've seen the children, like, something's- oh my god, they're right there. <laughs> something's going down. The door is opened. Like it. Oh my goodness, do I not like this. Let me see if I can just... No, I'm, I'm all good. I don't need to meditate, but... I'd like to just look around. It's a silk from a cocoon. Half of the Buddha's image is encased in silk. Let me just look around, okay? There's nothing in this corner. What about the other corner? <gasps> oh my god! Is it because I was running? It is. It definitely is. It's okay. I know how to meditate now. I'm enlightened, beaches. Okay. I guess that's what happens when I run around. I just attract those ghost things. A row of Buddhist images is visible in the dim light. Perhaps since the shrine lies in ruins, their expressions are sad. Oh good, I got more spider summon cards. And I thought I saw another item. I could be wrong though. My heart is beating so fast. An ancient Buddhist image is enshrined here. Well, I know that. Why is- why does my heart beat so fast over here in particular? <sighs> I don't know. It's weird. The Yakushi has a serene smile. It appears something could be placed in his hand! We have it! We have it! We're doing really good right now. Perfect. The medicine jar was placed in his hand. I like that she actually had the reflexes to go, oh, this thing under me, it's moving. I should probably move out of the way. She's smart. Main cellar. Okay, I don't like this, but it isn't quite as dark as 
everything usually is, which is nice. Sacred Cloth Mars. Oh, that's awesome. Oh. Okay. That's good. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's spikes. Is this a boss fight? Yeah, it is, because they're giving me healing items. I got Elixir. The corpse here appears to have been an astrologer. Okay. Maybe uh, what I just got, the cloth I just got, is for this. Seal Saturn has been placed on the door. Oh no, I don't have one? Oh man, what am I supposed to do? I don't have a Saturn seal. Well, looks like I'm out of luck. Oh, what is this? Silkworm Journal, Volume 3, Bloodstain Record of the Silkworm's Growth. July 21st, I ran into the Elder Priest when I went to the shrine to get some mulberry leaves. He looked at the worms and said, these are normal silkworms, unlike those found at the shrine. I wonder if that's true. I went to the temple to get mulberry leaves again today. The Elder Priest wasn't there, but Mio Shimaru said he saw the twins. I didn't see them, but I know he would not lie. When I returned from the shrine, the silkworms had started spinning cocoons. The silkworm started spinning silk yesterday. Today they're cocoons. Mio Shimari says we just have to wait. The cocoons are beautiful. They glitter like silver thread in the sunlight. The cocoons are just sitting there. Nothing is happening. I shook them because I was afraid they were dead. They made a rattling sound. Mio Shimari laughed and said they'll hatch soon enough. The moths have come out at last. After watching them for a while, I decided it's cruel to shut them up in a box. I was going to take them outside and let them go, but Mio Shimara stopped me. He said they can't survive outside. They all died as soon as they laid their eggs. Why do they have wings if they can't fly? That's a good question. You're kidding me. What the hell is that? Oh! <laughs> what the hell is that? That's a boulder demon. That's not the rock. It's the boulder. Oh my goodness. It's ah, it's a scorpion boulder. What the actual frickety frickety. <sighs> okay. Cool. Um rude. Is it okay? Uh, well, I don't like, I don't have, is there more? Oh my god, what's that red thing? What the heck was that? I don't have, uh, the Saturn seal that I need, so I'm gonna have to find that because I just don't have it. But it's probably in the temple somewhere I haven't looked, so that's the good news. Uh oh. Underground? Northeast? What does that mean you need it again? What?
She's got it bad right now. I must have been placed inside the chest while unconscious. My head is spinning, I don't remember. Well, yikes. Uh, you know, I only have one save. But I'm sure I'll find more. I'm just gonna have a positive, can do, I will find a save eventually attitude. I'm so glad I didn't miss this. Oh! You know what I just said? I'll find a save. And what did I find a save? I am really manifesting today. Oh good, and we have so many... So many spell cards and stuff. That's awesome. That also means we're gonna need them, but... I'm glad we found them. You know what? That's because I was running. Well, they're not even doing anything to me. They're just on their handy dandy way, aren't they? Are they just gonna walk around? I mean, I guess this one is. Um, I'll go ahead and summon a spider. And... Can I? Wow. This guy's really out to get me. Let me go ahead and summon another spider. Well, that one died. So that's great. I'm gonna... Oh my god, please summon another spider. I'm running! Look at my spider! Okay. Summon another spider, please! Cool. I am absolutely going to get this guy. <sighs> Let me go ahead and equip, uh, equip, equip, um, something else. Uh, I, I could use this one, you know? I could use that. Let's see what that does. Okay, I wasted two of them, but I didn't get hurt, and that's what's important. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and equip this one for emergencies, and I'll go ahead and do some meditation. And we're gonna see what's down here first. The scythe was removed from the body. Scythe stained with blood seems futile as a weapon. Okay. Uh, we must need that for something. A corpse has been discarded here. Huh, okay, that's all there is to that room. I hear footsteps. I wonder if that's... Oh, cocoon. Uh, we probably need the scythe for that cocoon, but I'm gonna go ahead and... Look over here. Just to see what's down here, I guess. I really... Everything's really wobbly. <gasps> there's a save! Oh, there's so there's lots of items, it looks like. Oh good, there's healing items. There was a save. Okay, and that's all it was. I'm really glad I went that way first. Okay, good, good, good. So... Now we need to use the scythe on this cocoon, I'm pretty sure, because what else would we do with the scythe? The silk has been cut in order to pass through. Okay, awesome. We're doing good. Nursery. Nursery? I wonder if it's like a silkworm nursery. I wonder if that's what they mean. <sighs> Gosh, it's so wobbly, but I can't... Ooh. Is... Is that what the nursery is? It's... A demon nursery? Ooh, there's tons of items here. Okay. 
Okay, awesome. We got more spider, more of that new puppet one. This. This has to be a boss fight because why else would I get those? Um. I'm gonna go ahead and equip those spiders, I think, just because. I want to use what I think would be like the lowest level stuff first before I use the higher level stuff. Oh look at this! Oh my god there's so much! I have like three saves now. And a lot of healing items. Oh I got a map too! Oh that's awesome. So that's where I came from and I've gone... It says I'm there? Or wait, it says I'm in the... I guess this is just part of the nursery? Huh. Okay. I mean... I guess I'm gonna have to confront this guy. Oh, this is my father. Father! What are you doing? I am caring after the people in the cocoon. Unless they merge with another creature, they can't survive. Unless these people merge with another creature, they cannot survive. Yes, my sister too. Entering a cocoon nine times will cure them. To help her, let her assimilate your flesh and blood. Never. You are the reason she is dead. Now it's your turn. A cocoon ruptures too early, merging will be a failure to prevent that from happening. Get into the wicker chest. Yes, father. What in the hell? What in the hell do you mean? The cocoon ruptured, revealing the remains of Agaki. So there are people inside these cocoons merging with these demons so that they can live? Is what I'm hearing? And our sister, Korea, is dead? Attempting to peer through the crevice was successful. Isn't that Korea? She's not there anymore. But there is a... a dead woman. And there's a chest. I mean, okay. I wonder if I need to meditate. Nope, it's just very wavy. Wait, where else would I go? I guess this is a dead end? Huh. How do I get over there, though? Parted the way for me. Perfect. As I go through, things seem to keep getting wavier. Oh, there's definitely something over there. It's like... It looked like a giant spider? A giant silkworm? Oh, it's one of those things. Got it. I do not have many cards left. Um. 
corpse hung from a rope sways in a memorizing memorizing rhythm. I'm pretty sure they meant to say mesmerizing. Ooh. A ton of corpses. Um, I'm gonna see if I can open this at all. The door won't open. Nope. Can't do it. Okay. Ugh. Wow, there's so many. Oh, the little girls are right there. For my sister. She is very close. They have like holes in the back of their neck. Okay, well, they went that way. I wonder if I can. Nope, see how Uranus has been placed on the door. Well, I definitely don't have that seal. Oh wow, that's a lot of boxes. Okay, they just giggled screamed at me. Oh, I have to search through all of them. Silk clings to the bottom of the chest. Okay. What about this one? Same thing. This one? Same thing. Oh! Is that her? people inside the cocoons, what are they thinking about? Two merge into one and dream a long, long dream. Two will merge into one. A long, long dream. Where am I? <gasps> Blood? Well, we see blood all the time. <sighs> we don't have a map available, huh? A bloodstained cloth was found inside the chest. Remove seal Neptune. Huh, I've never seen a Neptune door yet. Let me check to make sure there's nothing else. There isn't. Okay. Uh... Yikes. So there's a ladder, and there's a bridge. Huh. The waterfall flows into the spring where the shrine gate was built. Okay, so I can't do anything with that. <sighs> There's only one place to go. But I'm going to go ahead and end it there. Thank you guys so much for watching Kuon. This is uh, so weird and I love it. And I will see you guys in the next part where we find out what is at the uh the top of this ladder